if you are looking to buy a house right now, you know that shopping for a mortgage, mm -hmm. it can be very stressful and expensive, especially with these yeah. interest rates. They are higher than they've been in years. Well, that's what's prompted many to start looking into the possibility of assumable mortgages. Our Ellen Gallus talked with a real estate expert about what they are and some of the pros and cons. The rise in interest rates is keeping some buyers out of the housing market right now. But others are hoping to get creative. Emily Green, president of Minnesota Realtors, says more and more buyers are starting to ask about assumable mortgages. Most buyers are looking for any tool, any, you know, hidden program, um, anything they can do to get their payment more affordable. An assumable mortgage allows the buyer to assume the interest rate, the repayment period, the current principal balance, and other terms of the seller's mortgage rather than obtain a brand new loan. The obvious advantage, you might not have to pay as much in interest. But there are some drawbacks as well. Not all loans are assumable, and many times the cash requirement up front can be more since the buyer is paying the seller for the equity they already have in their home. Green says assumable sales can also be more complicated than a regular sale. And so the hardest part could be finding a willing seller. If they're able to find a buyer who can close in a month and they can walk away and move on to their next home, they're probably going to take that buyer's uh, purchase agreement over the buyer who says, well, you know, this could possibly take six months <laughs> and it's kind of uncharted territory. So you're really looking for that flexible and um, accommodating seller. Assumable mortgages were much more common back in the 1980s when interest rates were as high as 17 percent. These days they're much more rare, but that could change if interest rates continue to climb. Reporting in the newsroom, Ellen Gallus, 5 Eyewitness News.